My name is Melinda Kotler, and I am the co-founder and executive director of Talk Institute and School. My son was my original inspiration for starting the school. He is autistic and apraxic. We know that in many children with autism, they have sensory processing difficulties, so they experience senses differently than we do, and that includes sound, light, touch. Sounds that we might not even notice can be extremely painful for them. So those that are auditorily sensitive, they hear the teacher talking, the classmates talking, and they're unable to process what is important and what they should focus on. And instruction is very difficult because they can't figure out what they need to listen to. I've taught in two different rooms. One of them has the Owens Corning basement finishing system. The room that had the system was very beneficial because the room would absorb a lot of the sound so there wasn't much echoing and it disturbed the children in regards to what they were doing a lot less. In the room that I'm currently in that doesn't have the finishing system, when it does get very loud, it can disrupt things that are happening in the hallway, in other classrooms. So just having the benefit of having a classroom that keeps all the noise inside really helps the rest of the school. So I have five students. I used to be in the classroom across the hall that did not have the Owens Corning basement finishing system. And a couple months ago, we transitioned and changed classrooms. And now I'm in the finished classroom that has the sound absorbent walls. It's fantastic. It's made a huge difference in the way that the kids can focus and really respond a lot better now to the teaching. Daniel, how do you say kiss in Spanish? Beso. Can I have a beso? Can I have a beso? Thank you. My son's name is Daniel. He is now 12 years old. Daniel was diagnosed with autism when he was 16 months old. He went to kindergarten in his home district, but he wasn't progressing with his speech and language. He did not say his first words till he was six. And then at that time, we were working on getting him into the talk school, where he went for three years and did a phenomenal job, began talking, engaging, interacting. When the Owens Corning basement finishing system was put in at talk, Melinda Kotler, the director, talked to me about Daniel going into a classroom that had more soundproof capability. So he's able to pay attention to what he's being taught, what's going on around him. Melinda Kotler had recommended that Daniel would be an excellent candidate for the Owens Corning basement finishing system in our home. Daniel's a former student at talk. He is a wonderful, loving, kind little boy, very smart. He was extremely sensitive to sound. So I truly believe that having this system in his home will make a huge difference for him, both in terms of comfort and in terms of language. I think it will be a wonderful thing for him. This is where Daniel goes a lot of times when he needs peace and quiet. It's the heater room where the heater is and it will hum very loudly and Daniel comes in here and he'll bring in his pillow or his blanket and he'll lay down here just to kind of block out noise from the rest of the house. I'm hoping that with the Owens Corning basement finishing system that Daniel will have a place that gives him the same opportunity, a place where he can have some of the noise of his everyday world blocked out so that he can have peace and quiet and find a place to relax. I would just like to say that we're very appreciative of this opportunity to have the Owens Corning system put in our home, not just for my, our family, but especially for Daniel, who I think will benefit greatly from it. And I appreciate the fact that Owens Corning is really trying to look into how to benefit the population of autistic children.